Hello everyone, this is Al Hill, co-founder of TradingSim.com. To simulate the lesson that we're going to cover in this video, please visit TradingSim.com or give us a call at 888-610-2734. Hello everyone, this is Al Hill from TradingSim.com. Today we'll be discussing the Day Trading Cup breakout strategy as presented by Ken Calhoun. Before we get started, you'll need to configure your chart in order to size up the trade. First, you'll want to adjust your chart to a one minute time frame. Secondly, you will want to select a simple moving average of 35 periods. Third on your list, you'll want to add volume to your chart. At this point, you're now ready to uh, trade the market with this pattern. So in this example here, let's pause it for a second. On February 11th, if you look at this chart, FSLR in the afternoon had a pretty flat day. The stock began to drift sideways here. Now, when you see a number of cut patterns repeating themselves, that's a clear indication that you're in a sideways market. You'll see that the stock begins to just go up and above the 35 period average without a care. So here you'll see that the volume is somewhat higher on this bar, which is the start of the... Uh, the cup and this is the high for this bar is 3258 the stock then goes into a lull makes a low here and then comes out of it here you'll see the volume start to pick up in here at this point the stock makes a handle which is this tight formation here and a handle is another way of saying a, a flag if you will so at this point you have the actual formation the cup formation from the previous day you have a high of 32.58. So based on Ken Calhoun's method, you will want to buy the breakout of the previous day's high, which is 32.58, within the first hour of trading. And it has to come with higher volume. And it has to be 0.35% higher. You can see the volumes coming in here with first solar. We will want to buy a break of 3269. All right, so let's skip forward to see how that would have played out. As we skip to midday, you'll see that the stock broke out with volume. You'll see it here. 3269 was exceeded within two minutes of the open. FSLR then just kind of went up, made another high, came back down, tested the 35 SMA, and here it actually closed below it. So here's where we would have exited the position at 3307. In this example, in first solar, it went higher, but this is the market. It could just as quickly have gone lower. This is the day trading cup breakout strategy. Please visit tradingsim.com to simulate this lesson. Thank you.